Welcome back to TV5 News at 9. This weekend, Market at Uptown Bay City Show. Uh, showcasing talented artists and creatives in our area. And joining us this morning to tell us more about it is Brandon Strong. Brandon, thanks for being here. Yeah, thanks for having me. Yeah, so you're coming to us from the Great Lakes Market. So tell us about some of the things that people can find at the market. Yeah, so you'll find everything from apparel, candles, um, there's a lot of woodworking, uh, you name it, a lot of jewelry also. Oh, um, nice. Within reason, you name it, it'll be there. Nice. So what vendors do you think that you're most excited for people to come out and see? We do have a lot of painters. Mm -hmm. um, we have a lot of watercolors, some sketches, uh, some of the finer art, but in a reasonable price point, which I'm really excited about. Nice. So tell us, why do you think that people should support these local markets? Uh, I think everyone understands that right now the economy is a little rough mm -hmm. and especially for those entrepreneurs. Mm -hmm. um, almost everyone that you'll see there this weekend, they are their own little mom and pop shop. Mm -hmm. So yeah. any support is beyond appreciated. Yeah, it makes a big difference to our local community too, right? Yeah, uh, we have a lot of locals. We have uh, artists and creatives from Bay City, Essexville. Uh, Midland, Ludington, around the state, and even some out of the state. Nice. So tell uh, tell us, what should people know before they come and check the market out? Uh, so we have, this is our seventh year, mm -hmm. um, and we have adjusted the times. So this is the first year that we're doing a Friday evening, tomorrow from mm -hmm. 4 to 7, mm -hmm. and then Saturday from 10 to 5. So uh, that's the biggest thing is that we did adjust the times. Okay. So how can people check it, check it out? Where is the location? Yep. So we're located at uh, Uptown Bay City. Mm -hmm. So if you're not familiar with that, that's where Real Seafood is, the Steakhouse, um, Uptown Grill, and you can't miss the 70 tents. So just pull into Uptown Bay City and we'll be there. Okay. And this is only happening on Friday or is it throughout this whole weekend? Uh, just Friday evening, tomorrow okay. night and Saturday. And are there any more coming up or is this like the only one for this season? So we do four a year. Um, our uh, winter one will be December 1st and 2nd at From Buds to Blooms in Essexville. So we'll be in the greenhouse for winter. Okay, perfect. And if someone just wants to keep up with things that are happening with the market, do you have like a social media or yep, You can find us on like Facebook. That? Yep, The okay. Great Lakes Market. All right. So anything else that you want to let us know? Uh, there may be a little rain tomorrow during setup. It mm. almost always rains during setup, but usually <laughs> during show hours, we're usually good. So um, keep an eye on the rain, keep an eye on the weather, but you can kind of ignore it too. And really quick, will there be food vendors there as well? Uh, we will not have any food vendors, okay. but Uptown has many great restaurants that you can grab a snack at. Okay, so you go and shop and then go peruse the city and go get something to eat too. Yeah. So tomorrow night, if you're having dinner on your date night at Uptown, mm -hmm. uh, the perfect side thing to do for that will be visiting the Great Lakes Market. All right, lovely. Thank you, Brandon, for being here. Yeah, thanks again. All right. So if you want to learn more about all that's happening with the Great Lakes Market, all you have to do, go to the our website, WNEM.com, and go to the hot link section. That's right there for you.